one of my main goals is to make sure my kids are healthy and they have a roof over their head and food in their stomach and they're not going to bed starving. When the economy started going down a couple years ago, unfortunately, even my position, you wouldn't think would get laid off, but was getting laid off. From there, I went back to school, got a second degree, and I still haven't been able to find work. It can be hard, and when you have a big family, you have a growing teenage boy, you're a boy, you're growing, you're gonna eat, you're gonna want to snack. I don't want to cry. I've been very lucky to have the food bank at least help me provide food in my house for my kids to eat because it was really hard during the summer to try to keep up with food all day long with three kids <laughs> and not including nephew having friends over all the time and my house is open. If I have something to feed you, I will feed you. I don't like anyone to come over and knowing they're struggling and they're hungry. With the holidays coming and my daughter's birthday, it could be very frustrating and hard. I know one thing I could be thankful for is the food bank's helping me at least with putting a turkey on the table. We can have a traditional Thanksgiving and Christmas dinner. With the help of the food bank, I'm able to look more with work and not stress so much off of having food on the table for my children. I think if I had the opportunity to meet someone that's helped by donating food or money to the food bank, I would just be happy to tell them thank you and let them know firsthand who they've helped. I don't want to always have to rely on resources and agencies to always help me with things. I want to be able to provide it for myself and my family.